we're gonna make a video. A very good video. Mama Lisa, Mama Lisa, always in my view. Always in. I got the cannoli. I got the cannoli, Mama Lisa. Get to the kitchen right now. We're gonna be making a you a very delicioso, delicioso dish. I'm hoping that you like it. It's a for the kettle kitchen. Mr. Tony from the kettle kitchen wanted me to make a, a Italiano dish. Yes, we're gonna make a you a Italiano dish. I don't know if you're gonna go like or if you're not gonna go like. Well, we hope you're gonna go like uh, Italiano dish. What do we call it? We call it Italiano dish. And Mama Lisa over here laughing at me. <laughs> Mama Lisa, Mama Lisa, what are you doing, Mama Lisa? I'm making some manicotti. Mod Father Manicotti. Mod Father Manicotti. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it when Mama Lisa cook Italiano style. Mm -hmm. Especially since I'm German. <laughs> <laughs> gotta love it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're gonna so cook this for. I'm gonna cook it for, till it's almost done. Okay, so 90%, 90% yeah, done? Yeah, 80 to 90% finished. Okay, and yeah, this is done. Italian sausage. Sweet. Italian sausage, and this is hamburger, right? It's hamburger, but we added oh, it's Italian spices seasoned. and stuff, so it's Italian seasoned hamburger. Okay, so we'll have the seasonings that she used in the description. Yes, I have them. This one here is already seasoned. It's store bought. It's called Sweet Italian Sausage. So once we get those cooked up and ready to go into the shells, we'll bring it back. Sounds good. Go. Okay, now we have the meat. Cook to but so you yeah, get red. 80, 90 percent. Okay, done. so you basically cooked all the red out. Yes. Okay. So we have to layer the sauce on the bottom. It's gonna go sauce on the bottom. Okay, so this is a little uh, like a ragu or something. What is this? No, it's just um yeah, ragu spaghetti sauce. That's all it is. Okay, Pasta sauce, basically. Pasta sauce, okay. And just spread it. Layer. Well, I guess you can put it however thick you want to because you're going to pour more on top. You're going to cover them. Uh, it's all going to go to the bottom. Of the yeah, so you're putting it on the bottom just so at least each one of the each one of the manicottis gets the coating. Yes. Okay. So now we can take the tape. The Italian sausage, Italian hamburger. You got the Italian, Italian you got one meat on one end, yeah. a cheese in the middle, and then the other meat on the other end. Yes. Okay. I got you. So you're going to put meat, cheese, meat. But yes. there are two types of meat, so. And then you're going to layer. Right. Okay. Make it nice and tight. Okay. And we'll do the next one and we'll bring you back when we're finished. Okay.
Oh, I see you turned them. You were doing the other I way, did, I guess. yeah, because I have more. Just, I can fit more this way. I got you. Yeah. Oh, so you see you're putting cheese in the middle now. Cheese in the middle. Oh, okay. Why'd you do that? Um, it was a suggestion. It was. By yours. By the mod father? By the mod father. father. It was a suggestion by the mod father. I made her an offer she couldn't refuse. <laughs> Do it or else, right? <laughs> no. No. That way. Kind of even up even up the meat. So if you put the cheese in the middle first, guys, it's it stops. The meat. And then and then when you go put the meat, it the meat uh, the, the cheese will stop you from over overfilling. something? No, the oven's done. Ready. Oh, the, the oven's, oven's ready. ready. It's preheated to 350 degrees, looks like it. Um, yeah, so oh, she's stuffing these mancati. Um, just want to say thank you to Tony Kettle while we're thinking about it. and uh, For allowing us to be a part of this great yeah. collaboration. collaboration. There's quite a bit of... Uh, There's like two videos every day, I right. think. Okay, you got one last one that she's stuffing. Last one, yes. And here's the cheese that she used. And the pasta sauce. And here's the cheese that she'll sprinkle over. On top. Whatever leftover meat's left over. Right, yeah. We'll just uh, yeah. sprinkle it all. So now what are you gonna do? So you got all, all you got all your mancotti yeah, filled. Yeah, I got them all in there. I got them all. You got them filled. all. You got them all ready to go. I'm gonna put some sauce over. Okay. A little bit of sauce, some thin layer. I'll add some more in a minute. More the smell. You could. I wish you had smell of vision. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Can't wait to waste it. Mm -hmm. So we did not boil the noodles ahead of time because with the sauce and uh, it'll cook, they'll cook in the sauce. Okay. So now with the leftover meat, she's gonna kind of just sprinkle it over the top. Just to mm -hmm. use it up. And that's the meatballs. This is the Italian sweet Italian sausage. So this is the sweet Italian sausage that's left over. I'm just going to sprinkle it. Mama Lisa, Mama Lisa, you're making it smell so good here in the casino. Mm -hmm. That's good. I hope it comes out. I'm excited to taste it. Okay. Now okay. I'm gonna piece right here. Now I'm gonna put uh, some more sauce. Okay, now that you got that sauce, the Italian sausage. Now what do you do? I'm gonna put. I'm gonna use up this cheese. Oh, okay. And uh, you're just gonna cut it up and sprinkle it. Cut with it in you. half and just put it over. Put it here and there. Yeah. There and here. So I use it Keep up. Put it everywhere. Ooh, that's it's gonna be so good. Cheesy, cheesy, cheesy. Kind of like my jokes, huh? 
<laughs> That's a good one. Yeah. I call it like I see it. We're gonna have lots of cheese. I like cheese. Toby loves that cheese too. Yeah, he sure does. You say the word, you watch. He'll be over here yep. in a second. Okay. And then I guess now you put more sauce? Yes, I will put then, the rest of the sauce, probably. Okay. Um, meeny, meeny, miny, moe. Right there. I'll put the rest of the sauce. And I actually have more in the jar, but I don't, to I don't want, yeah, I don't want to overdo it. I think this will be just enough. Yeah. Once it gets all in there and mixed up and bubbling and mm -mm -mm. I can eat that right now. Of course, those yeah. manicotti is a little bit tough right the now. The noodles are hard. But the sauce and everything will get them softened up. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. It's good to me. I'm going to put this. This is shredded mozzarella. Or grated. Grated mozzarella. It's really. That's when we did, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, so we grated that by hand. We have a little cutter, I mean, grater, grater and we grated that. You don't have to buy it, you can make, you can cut your own. Yeah, just buy the... I don't know how much. You want me to use it all? Hey, I say cheese is good, more cheese is better. <laughs> Okay, well, that answers my question. You can't, you, you can't get too much cheese. That's for me. Now, some people may not be able to handle that much cheese. Well, we like Italian food, too, so. Mm -hmm. Okay, now this needs to go in. Mama Lee said you did such a good job. Needs to go in the oven. Okay. All right. So we're going to put it in a 350 degree oven. Preheated already. Ours is preheated. And I'm going to do it for about 40 minutes. I think it says about 40 to 50. But I'm going to check it at 30. Okay. Okay, guys. We'll okay, bring you right going. back. Okay. 30 minutes is up. So we're going to check it. Look at that, look at there. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's see. Still kind of... I mean, it's probably done. I'd go in five minutes. Ten minutes. Ten minutes, yeah. 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 Still feels a little hard. Yeah, that one in the middle is still hard.
Mama Lisa, Mama Lisa, the spread looks so good. Oh my goodness. It does. Cheers. Oh my goodness, Mama Lisa. Mm -mm -mm. Look at this beautiful, beautiful mancari she made for us. The Italiano dish that we promised. Thank you for coming to our cocina. So Mama Lisa can show you how she make a harmonic cod. My father way. All right, now we're gonna try this. Okay. Oh mm -hmm. my goodness, that mm -hmm. looks so delicioso. I love it. Perfect. Mm -hmm. oh. drop right there. Mm -mm -mm. Well, ladies and gentlemen, y'all, folks, <laughs> This is Domenicati, that Lisa made for Tony Kettles. For Anthony, Anthony, <laughs> Anthony, Anthony, Anthony Kettle. Anthony. Let's see. Kettle Kitchen. Oh my goodness. That's good. Mama Lisa, mm. she outdid herself this time. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is so good. Mm -hmm. Look, see why I put the rag there? Mm-hmm. Can't take you anywhere. Mm. <laughs> this is good. I would make this again. This is outstanding, folks. Now that I know how to I'm make not, it. <laughs> I'm not Italian, but if I had this, in fact, let me have a. Mm -hmm. Got some breadsticks here. Got the salad. Got the works. Got some good wine. Excellent, excellent uh, company. Oh, thank you, babe. And we have a dog running around here somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, you, you, you don't know what you're missing. Got some salad. Oh. Mm. Did you get the cannoli? Mama Lisa, I got the cannoli. I got the cannoli and the mancati. Okay, then we got dessert. <laughs> Where's the flan? <laughs> Oh wait, scratch that, that's Mexican. <laughs> this is Italian. <laughs> wow. Mm -mm -mm. And it didn't take, I mean, this will feed us for at least two more times. Yep, this is perfect. And there wasn't a whole lot. It was like 12, you know, one box. It has 14 of those manicottis in it. Yeah, so one box of manicotti will, will fill one casserole dish, right? Roughly. Mm -hmm. That's perfect. It wasn't hard to do. And we didn't have to boil the noodles first. Nope. Pasta. The pasta noodles. We did, think, we did end up cooking it a total of one hour. I think this out does, this out does lasagna because it has the sausage and the meatball. The hamburger, yeah, that's hamburger. fine. And the cheese. We could even do some, sprinkle some Parmesan cheese on it too. Just like you do spaghetti. Right. Mm -mm -mm. Mama Lisa did a good job. You got to love Mama Lisa. Mm -hmm. 